Hello everybody, and well, this isn't a let's play, this is just me playing Amnesia the Dark Descent the first time, and so I'm gonna continue. Yep, so yeah, this is not gonna be a let's play, like, this is just one video of me playing this game, and so far, I was just, my, I'm scared, this game has scared the crap out of me, I mean, I can't even play it. I mean, yesterday I was playing, and then I just like, I was like, I just totally quit, I was like, screw this, I'm stopping. Turn off. Yeah, so I'm gonna try to be a bit more courageous in this uh, right now. I'm trying to be. I'm playing with the lights on, but it's still late. It's late, but at least I have the lights on, you know? Hopefully, you can hear. Wait a second. Okay. You should be able to hear the game now. Uh. Good. Anyway. Yeah, so I totally been scared so let's see now let's walk shit oh I just started uh, I've seen this bit before oh man ah <laughs> oh my god. Oh man. Where is it? Where did, where did it go? I'll stop with the music. Where is it? Oh, did it land there? No, I don't want it there. That's way too close. No. Oh, the lag made me drop this. Way up. Okay, go. Ah! Ah! Well, I don't know where to go. <laughs> Get on! Oh, how the hell did it get in here? How's my oil? Oil. Oh, it's, it's right there. Is there anything I can throw? Aha, yes. Go. Fetch. Not that close! Ugh. Get on! Oh, it's still eating. No wait. Oh, there's nowhere to jump. Where is it? Where is it? Oh my god, man, where is it? As far as you can. Oh, right there. Wait, let's. Turn. Hurry. It's coming! Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! Uh, oh, I only got one lord in him left. Should I, should I hit myself? Oh, it's right there too. Um. Uh, uh, where is it? I don't want to jump over now. I think it's gonna hit me in mid jump. Uh, Can't I grab one of these? No. Ah, where is it? I can't grab any of stuff. I'm st I think I'm screwed, man. It's 
to stride jumping. Yep, 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 yep. What's this? Oh, the lantern. That one is still bleeding quite badly. Ah, something large brushed against his leg and he felt himself being dragged along by the current of the beast. He pushed himself above the surface. Help, he cried, as the ocean swallowed him again. Help! Oh, God, man. Oh, I'm in water. No, run. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Can it walk through doors? Ah. Oh. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Run! Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Oh, 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 oh my god. He felt himself being hoisted out of the ocean. The liquid hull of SS Hortensia glittered in the smoothing warm yellow light of setting sun he turned as his head oh man oh I'm out of the water oh my god that was that was scary man oh my god oh I was so tense man I hate him when the, when I have to run from stuff like that especially something I can see how's my uh, oh my few got some bruises oh well, at least that heals over time or apparently it doesn't anyway. oh nice music Oh, creepy fountain, but nice music. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, peaceful music. The only place that has made me feel better so far. Oh, my God, that was tense, man. That was tense as hell. I mean, running from that thing. I mean, that was creepy and... Ugh. And this is the scariest game ever. I've ever played. Not ever. Well, the only real horror game I've ever played before is Fear. But this game is scarier than that. Oh, yeah. Box? Yes! I need that stuff. Close that. One thing I did that kind of annoys me. Well, not annoys me. It's, like, it's not that realistic. Like, if you put something there and then you exit the room. Uh, then it's, it's not where you put it anymore. I don't know if that's like to creep you out or more a bit, or it's just a flaw, or just something with the game. I don't know, man. I don't, I don't even want to progress anymore. This is the best place ever. <sighs> oh. oh my god. Study? I don't want to go to the study. I want to. I want to. I want to. I want to go to the guest room. He returned to the teacup of the saucer and picked up the orb as one with an apple and pondered on the strange happenings. Yeah, he p picked the orb like Isaac and Newton picked up his, the apple. I was like, gravity. Oh my god. Man, that was bold. That was creepy as hell. And the fact that you have to run away from that thing in water. Oh, what's wrong? Oh, these things. They want to know what you've been writing. That's what they want. Oh, why are these open? Oh, look, a crowbar. Should I pick that up? No, not yet. Nothing. Nothing. Second of July, 18. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of the Hermit's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled the lion. about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned 
without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. Yeah, as if maimed by a lion. Maybe he was maimed by a lion. How do you know that? How do you know not? Because lions aren't in the desert, you dumbass. Oh, yeah, right. Anyway. Oh, clothes. Can we put those on? No. So I can hide behind them. I've seen someone that, like, if you... I think... On the game wiki or something. I don't know. I forgot where I've seen it. If you hold something in front of you, the monsters don't attack you. But I haven't encountered a monster yet. And I'm not looking forward to it. By any means. I'm really scared. I don't want to encounter any monsters. Although a game would be nothing without the enemies, but still. Oh, a bed. Let's go to sleep. Oh, what? Well, oh, again. Yes. You better do so. Or I got a gun, you know. Oh, really? Where is it? It's in my second drawer. Why? So I can take it until you won't kill me. A crowbar. Oh my god, that's the first time I've ever picked something without having something happening. I mean, every single time. Every time you something, I picked up something so far. It's like, either you hear a roar, either flesh starts to growing out of the walls, either you, you, you say something. The, the, either the ground starts trembling. Let's see what's here. Nothing. Anything in there? No. In here? You. Uh oh. Laudanum. I need that because I. Well, I didn't. Oh no, I didn't. Wait, did I use. Oh, yeah, I did. Shut up. Okay. Now, I've been waiting for this time because I don't want to play this game during the day because it's not that scary. I want it to be scary. It's probably stupid, but whatever. Nothing in there. Third of July. I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, We covered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? You forgot. I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself, where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Oh, who knows? Maybe you've got magic air bags. Maybe you can breathe longer. Sucks we can't go under in water in this game because we would have tested that out and see how long you could have kept your air. Yeah, you always have to throw stuff in this game for it to break. Or a stock to a brook to you to a broken lock. Hmm. The dock's broken. Find our way to open the closet. The ornum. Hmm, let me guess. Do we need to use this? <laughs> An important key is hidden in the guest room. Oh yeah, flashbacks. Oh my god, oh my god. No, close the door. Oh my god, what's wrong? I don't tell me it's a monster, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh, don't open the doors. Don't, don't try to check, just let it. 
Oh god. Oh god. Better not get in here, man. I'm gonna be. Oh my god. Oh my god. Better not find me, man. Oh my god. Oh. Did he leave? I'm not waiting until that music's gone, man. That's creepy music. Is it gone? Oh. Just a little bit long. Oh. I'm gonna keep both these doors open so that if it comes back, I can go run back right in there. Oh, sucks it broke the door, man. I can't close it at the back. Mm, nothing. Uh, nothing. Mm, mm, well, it would be nothing. Well, it is nothing unless, unless he can wear clothes, but he doesn't put them on. 4th of July, 1839. It's done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausted nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The red pieces lay spread across the table as I left them, but somehow, I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault, I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. Oh, just don't complain. Just now you have the orb. Just well, I don't know. Just be proud. You do. Hmm. Huh? K, yay, K. I'm gonna get an out of here now. Screw this. Uh, screw this. Let's go. Back hall. He panted heavily, trying his best to keep himself from screaming. The medicine cabinet had been overturned and lay collapsed on the floor. He reached through the broken glass door and grabbed all the sedatives he could find. Ugh. Oh man, that was bullshit. That was scary. Hope nothing. It's not. I better not be in here. Ugh. Stupid thing. Hello. Hello. Oh, lag. Anybody there? Oh, not storage. I've seen this area. Well, some of it anyway. Well, I've seen it. I know it's dark. That's all. Oh, I don't want to. Oh, man. Storage out. <laughs> <laughs> Sir William Smith had been marked. There was no way for him to know that the young man from the other day had cast such a terrible shadow. <gasps> Shadows and shadow, shadow, shadow. Oh, man. Oh, and now there's monsters too. This is gonna be perfect. <sighs> oh man. And there's monsters as well. Oh, this is gonna be scary as hell. Okay, let's check my supplies. <laughs> Wait. Oh, the machine room. Oh, please, let's just see. Got to see you're doing well, Daniel. I'm sure as hell. Oh man, stop writing it. The darkness in the storage feels strange and unnatural. Now oh, does it? Um. Can I? Open? No. Can I? Open? No, I can't open that. What do you mean by the darkness in here? It feels strange and unnatural. 
equipment. Ugh. Man everywhere, I just don't want to go anywhere in this game. Stop lagging. Don't need lag. Wait a second. Ah, that ain't good. I was still gonna block it anyway. Come on. I don't. I want this place to be blocked. Turn it off, cause. It's... Yeah. Ah. Oh. Monster. Slight headache. And why is your vision going so wonky? Slight headaches don't do this kind of stuff. Oh man. Your head sucks, dude. Gone. I am scared. It's freaking crap right now. I don't even want to compl com continue playing. There. I don't even turn the lights off for me, thanks. I'm, I think it went the other way. So I'm going this way. I don't care. Oh, this is black. So I guess I'm going down here. I don't care. I'm going for it. So I don't. Because the more I take long, the more I get scared. So I'm just going to go. Run like hell. Wait. Oh, why do all doors have to open, open that way, man? Why can't one of them just open the other way, this way? Instead, so I can block it. Okay, so... Yeah, that's better. That kind of makes it obvious. Oh, there's still another part. Okay. No monster? Please? No monster. Man, I'm even scared to open doors in this game. I know I might be exaggerating a bit. I mean, like, I may be getting too scared. I'm just way too scared. This game is just... Ugh. I mean, the fact that you can't even... Because at least if you had a gun or something... Obviously, guns didn't exist in this... I don't think there was, or anyway. Probably did, but I don't know. Oh, there's the inner part. But first... Bring this in. Bring this in. Which way does this door open? Oh, I don't know. Okay, anyway, I'm just gonna block that. this I'm gonna crap myself because at least if you like had a gun or something well at least I'd be comfort a bit in that because like you have a way to defend yourself yeah you can't do nothing oh bring that here uh, yeah. hello come on there's 
There's got to be something now. Come on. Uh, even my own steps scare me, man. Um, okay, then. You better not come right when I open the damn door, man. Hello? Okay. Seems to be empty. I've seen most of storage. But still. I don't know when the monster shows up exactly. Slight headache. Probably using way too much tinder boxes, but uh -huh, oil, tinder box, load new, good, good, all good. In here, does this hammer bring anything back? <sighs> anyway, okay then. Oh. What sucks too is because you can't even look at your enemies, man. Because, like, this guy freaks out even when he looks at the monsters. So, like, if you want to see where the monster is, so you know where he is, well, you can't. Where's the primary one then? Because he'll be like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, that's so freaking, that's so, it's just a scary monster, man. I don't want to look at it. I'm going crazy. Close the door. Oh, no. Light. Light the candle. What is that? I keep hearing crumbling noises, man. Alexander, I have prepared the explosives you needed for clearing the flood drain. I can't stress enough how important it is that the mixture is handled with care. Please try to tell your feather-brained servants this before you go ahead and with your plans. The liquids are not by themselves explosives and should be kept separated to avoid further mishaps. I have arranged two large vats in the next room for, your, for the ingredients. All you need to do now is mix the liquids and you are ready to go. Why is my music stop? My usual music, that is. Okay, there we go. That's my music. So it's, it's not like it's good music, but they, but I don't know. I mean, silence. Ah, there we go. Creeps me out. But even like when it's too silent, it creeps me out. But even certain music creeps me out. Aha. Picked up explosive. Oh my god, no. Hello? A slight headache. Come on, I just did progress. You ruined it with your stupid roars. Okay, so there's no monster. Oh, lag. There's no monster music, so I'm. Oh, what's that? Oh! Stop freaking out, dude. You just did some progress. Turn the light off. Duck. 
It's gonna be right there, isn't it? I'll no, screw. I'm just going in. I don't care. Yeah. I'll quick go, go, go. The rubble from a cave is hindering further passage in the storage. Find a way to get through. You're getting. Thought I just heard a monster. Oops. No double click. Double press tab. Progress. Crystal. Hey, let's go. Cause it scares me even more when his vision goes like all bull crap and stuff. It's like it starts playing with him. Machine parts. I'm doing this. Cause it's an awesome game. but it's creeping up. Freak out of me. I turn no way, don't turn the light on, I know this area. And I know what that door there holds inside of its I don't want it coming out. Right? Just I hope it's that door. Better not be this one. Hungry Daniel? Want some Nash meat? Can I use this as a weapon? Well, you could at least brought a crowbar or something, man. To beat something up with, you know? Ah, oh, stupid lady crying. Shut up. Deal with it. Oh, physics, oh. Nice physics, say. Eh? Ah, oh, get off me. Nice physics, because I mean, it's me, so that's so much better. <laughs> Very mature of you, Daniel. I do you think so? Yes, during this situation. I'm just trying to pick up the mood. Uh, okay, then. Okay, yeah. Uh, Ouch. Ow. 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 Stop it. Leave her alone. Well, hopefully that would put her an end to her crying, so. Whatever. This son of a. <gasps> Why? Why do that crap? Because you hate me, that's why. No. Oh. Right. Okay, pick up the note. It's a full. There's. It's a, if a full set of three rods is unavailable, well, the title is in case of a missing rod. Anyway, just in case you don't know, there is one rod in the inner study rooms, which might work in case the elevator breaks down again, unless it is a absolutely, absolute. No, shut up. Necessary. Always use the spare rods in the storage before using a mended one. You should probably listen to this guy. Is it absolutely necessary? Yes, for progress purposes. Yep. But always, see, it was crystal clear for one minute, one second. But now that roar is making him freak out again. I'm gonna get killed here, aren't I? Probably am. It's not in here, I don't think. <clears throat> oh, try to put the mood up. Bam 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 I don't know how long I've been playing now. And just so you know, after Resident Evil 5, Doom 3 should be coming up. Well not should be. I mean what I meant by should be if like 
I don't know if I'm gonna start right after, just don't record, or not stop recording for a little while. Anyway, back to Amnesia, real scary game, yeah, you already know that probably. So fucked up shit, man. I'll stop making those, oh, he's hearing those crunchy noises and bleh. It's like, <laughs> his brain is cracking, that's what's happening. A few cuts and bruises. Four phase amplitude rod and machine part made out of wood. Trinity. Machine. Why did I do that? I don't know. Because I'm, I'm an asshole. Well, I'm not an asshole actually. Now his vision is going all bullcrap like and. Oh, cool, you can see it through here. It's gonna be right there, isn't it? Man, why do I have to go right when the monster... Because there's only one way of the monster left. There's only one way for it to go. And I have to go that way. Why? Why do you do this? Because you just want... That was what this game was made to do, you know? It was kind of made to make you go through places where you don't want to go. Do you know? No, I don't know, actually. Ah. Uh. I can't see. Oh, where did it go? Screw it. I'm running. Does the monster disappear? Like after once it's done its encounter and stuff, and then fine. Does it disappear? Does it keep patrolling around? If I am stopping right here. Screw this. I'm going. I don't give a shit. I'm going. <gasps> ah! Where should I hide? Where should I hide? Yeah, so online, Daniel. That's right. How am I supposed to leave this place? It's right where I need to be. Oh, so you can see he's shaking, because, like, even the object... Oh, shit, why did they make that noise? Even the object he's carrying starts seeing, like... Man, that, those sound effects don't do this any, make this any easier, you know? It's like, how's my sanity? Oh, look, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I'm, lo I'm, I'm losing it, man. I'm losing my mind. Oh. Oh, come on, Daniel. Snap yourself. Snap out of it. Come on. Uh, slap yourself a couple of times, Daniel. Is that better? Let's see. No. He's still going crazy. How about thinking about your when you were little and your mummies used to come with the teddy bear? Remember your little tele teddy bear, you know? Those little teddy bears and soft toys. All the good memories, anyway. Oh, you can't even aim when when he's going crazy, man. Oh, look at that. How can I play? The monster's gonna hear him as well, it's like, <laughs> he's doing like this, and the monster's gonna hear me. And I can't see a thing, and I need to turn the lamp turn on, but I can't, because it will see me. Go, just go. Got out of storage, my friend. Oh, and we're out. And I'm happy now, kind of. He flipped through the Book of Monarchs, looking for ant etchings and, con and counted. Nine different kings from all over Europe had them been depicted with a nor breasting in their hands. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, why did, I, why did I get this game? Why? Because it looks awesome on video. Oh come on, you gotta, you gotta feel better in here now. I'm gonna stay here a while until his sanity is like slight headache. Because I think unless you do progress, that's the best it can be. Stop going insane, come on. Snap out of it. Don't forget your bag, Daniel. I wouldn't have a There is no shade using a parasol in the desert. As it happens, it's imperative to your survival. 
but it looks ridiculous. The shade will hurt much less than that, I assure you. He patting on that on the back. Come on, Daniel. Snap out of it, man. Let's slip in some water. Well, actually, more water don't probably won't bring so many good memories since all that monster. What is this here? Who broke my wood? What is that? Is that wood? Oh my god, that's a dead body on her! Didn't even realize it. Why the fuck? You're doing this to me. Even the nice little areas. Now you're trying to creep me out with stupid dead bodies that weren't there before. That's immature. I, was, I don't look at it, just stand here, light in the light. Come on. It's gotta account for something, come on. Shut out of it, dude! Man time? No, it doesn't even do barely any light. I'm not gonna waste oil just to make him, his stupid brain feel better. Ah, my aim's coming back, so I think I know. Why are you so bloody f fucking scared? You're in, a, you're in a nice little area now with a little centipede thing with wi with wings. Again on it. There, the monsters can't reach you now, Daniel. How are you feeling better now? Oh my god, man, this guy sucks. Come on. I thought the game said you're supposed to stand in light. To make you feel better. I've been standing here now for like three minutes. Or two. Or one. Maybe. I don't know. I oh, screw this, I'm going I'm going, I don't, I don't care. I don't wanna waste your guy you guys time, but we went in here. Let's go with him. Go on, maybe using the machine room can make him feel better. Let's close the door. Always. And I don't know if I should close doors, because like should I close the door so that nothing comes in, or should I open the door so if com something comes in here, I can run out fast? You have the sending room. Will it take us to the inner sanctum? It will definitely take care of the vertical part of our journey. So, you have ridden an elevator before? Yes, the Colosseum of Regent's Park. It takes you to the gallery where you can view the panel Good. This ride might be a little longer, and in the other direction. I mean, down. Why? Yeah, I don't think guns existed though, because like, with elevators or something. Oh yes, head is pounding and hands are shaking. It's not a good thing, but it's better than dot dot dot. Ah, there. Listen to the nice little music, Daniel. It's locked. Wait a second. Oh, wait, actually, I'm making progress. Screw this. It's nice music. I want it. Better, you, better you continue while that music is going on. The strange letter frightened him, but it was also the only one which offered him some comfort. I'm guessing it's the letter that the Baron sent him. It's like, I think. You okay, then? Hands are hands are shaking. Oh, why do you have to stop the music right now? We're in new ground here. And I want my music. Stop crying. Is there something in here? No, it's not. July, 1839. Today, I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. Professor Taylor of the Faculty of History was very helpful, and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. The most interesting aspect was the prevalent trace they had left in our culture. The mythic orbs may, in fact, have inspired the Globus Cruciger, which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. As I was leaving, I overheard a disturbing conversation. Sir William Smith, the geologist, was killed last night. Less than a fortnight had passed since I'd asked for his expertise. I know it's silly, but I can't help feeling responsible somehow. It's not silly, you were totally responsible. And admit it, Dan, you're a murderer, you bastard. Oh, who cares? 
Who bloody cares? I just want to get through with this game. Kind of. Well, actually, I don't want to end it. Because, like, it's an awesome game. And probably... And it's only, like, awesome to play once, maybe. Because, well, it's the only the first time that you get real scares and stuff. And the second time you play, you already know it's going to come and stuff. I want to complete it. But at the same time, I want it to last long, you know? But I really want to complete it, though. I think it's better to complete it. What are those sounds? Ah, hata. Okay, nothing. In Kerlin. Yeah. Close door. Yeah. Hog. Notes. 14th of July, 1839. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers of varying importance. Today, I got one which differed greatly from the others. From a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Protect me from what? Is someone after me? I looked up Brennenburg and traced it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes me greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. A sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful, with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. Tomorrow, I shall visit my physician, Dr. Tate, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. Good. Good for you, Daniel. Yeah. Nice work, Daniel. Why did you listen to the damn guy? Come to Brunningburg Castle. I'm gonna fucking kill that asshole. Alexander, you're gonna die, bitch! Why did you get me to this place? It's freaking creepy and scary and as hell. Note that there's there are only two spare rods left in the storage for the elevator machinery. Oh, so where's the third one then? Make sure to only discard the ones which are badly damaged. And keep the others in the inner study rooms in case of all three would crack again. Wait a second, I don't have two. Where's the third one then? Oh, whatever. Anyway, so what is this? Uh, Trinity angles and triangle. Trinity triangle. Get it? Get it, Trinity? Whatever. Four phase. I'm guessing that's a square. Four phase. One, two, three, four. Oh, why is his? Why is he so freaking scared? There's like there's nothing in here. There's not even sounds. For God's sake. Uh, by time by now I would have probably gone insane. I was like. <laughs> Okay, stop, stop. Stop it now. Calm down, for God's sake. 17th of July, 1839. How has this escaped me? They're all dead. Limbs scattered, heads split down the middle, their skin flayed as if boiled. Ouch. I feel like I'm falling into myself. What's happening? Sir William Smith, Professor Taylor, now Dr. Tate. Is it following me? How can it not be? It's the damn thing I brought from Africa. Something is after me. I have no choice but to trust the bad. Damn it, why? You better know what he claims. If he is wrong, I suspect he'll regret it as well. Yeah.